Gripping on the come up with a 211 in my mind Persuaded by the devil gripping on my black Passing now, searching for what look that I can hit with murder in my soul Swinging bendy corners in the 67 L code Hello everyone in this video, I'll be talking about Straw Hat's bounties at the end of the series. Nami has already mapped all the areas that she has traveled, and it can be assumed that she will create a world map once the story is over. At the end of the series she will be the best navigator of the world. Nami is already a smart woman, capable of manipulating the weather to a great degree. With Zeus, she's going to be a truly fearsome opponent. Her final bounty will reach at least 500 million berries. Soul King Brook was the real MVP of the whole Cake Island even if we do not know yet if his bounty has increased or not. I think his final bounty will be about 600 million berries also due to the fact that he will be one of the strongest members of the King of Pirates crew. Somewhere later in the series, closer to Raftel possibly, Chopper realizes that Luffy is dying from the very same disease as Roger did. He then dedicates his time to try and save Luffy, succeeding by finding ways to cure this incurable disease. The world government will realize the real power of Chopper and will begin to see him as a serious threat and not just a pet. His final bounty will reach about 600 million berries. Frankie is the strongest crew member after the Big Four Luffy, Zoro, Sanji and Jinbei. At the end of the series Frankie will have fulfilled his dream to create and travel with a dream ship which would experience countless battles, can overcome extreme hardships and can reach the end of the Grand Line. His final bounty will be at least 700 million berries. At the end of the series Usopp will be a brave warrior of sea and the best sniper of the world. As a commander of the Pirate King he will have a final bounty of at least 800 million berries. At a young age, Robin acquired a bounty of 79 million berries for having the ability to read Poneglyphs, which told of the Void Century. In the current storyline Nico Robin is the only person alive who can read the language written on Poneglyph tablets. This alone is enough to make her too big a threat to the world government. At the end of the series Nico Robin will be the one to learn the true history of the One Piece world including the Void Century. Her final bounty will reach at least 1 billion berries. At the end of the series Jinbei will be on of the three strongest commanders of the Pirate King. Since the three and four strongest Yonko commanders have a known bounty of about 800 to 1 billion 320 million berries, his final bounty will be about 1 billion 200 million berries. As the third strongest member of the Pirate King's crew, Sanji will be one of the strongest characters in the The World at the end of the series. He probably will be the fastest fighter of the world and his final bounty will be about 1 billion 500 million berries. At the end of the series Zoro will be the greatest swordsman in the world and the right-hand man of the Pirate King. In terms of power he will probably be Yonko level and his final bounty will be about 2 billion berries. Currently, Luffy has gained a bounty of 1 billion 500 million berries and has unofficially been titled the Fifth Emperor of the Sea. At the end of the series Luffy will take down Blackbeard and will become the Pirate King. For this reason, Luffy's bounty will become the highest bounty ever seen in the series. Since Gold D. Roger had a bounty of 5 billion 564 million 800 thousand berries, Luffy's final bounty will reach 5 billion 600 million berries. Only after becoming the Pirate King, Luffy will take down the world government. 